Remember most from school? A teacher, a principal, maybe your coach? Well, there's a national competition on way to recognize an unsung hero of the schools, and that's the person who keeps the building clean and comfortable. Local 12 News reporter Jeff Hirsch introduces us to a tri-state man who is a national finalist for Janitor of the Year. Be careful. Have fun today, guy. For the past Hello, 23 yeah. years, Brady Harris has brought warmth to cold days and sunshine to cloudy days for the students and staff at Hilltop Elementary School in Wyoming. Sophie. Grady is the custodian at Hilltop. That's his official job, unofficially. I don't even think of Grady as a custodian. I think he's just kind of an ambassador to the school system. Hello there, how are you? Teacher Brian Pittman nominated Grady for the Janitor of the Year competition run by Cintas, a custodial supply company. Grady is one of 10 national finalists. It may seem impossible to say that Grady is always upbeat, but it's true. What I love about the job, especially kindergarten through fourth grade, these kids are totally honest, and no matter what, you're guaranteed a smile or a laugh every day you come to work. So I think that's what's great about it to me. Whenever um, I see him, he's always smiling. Twin third graders Della on the right and Amelia Kaiser pretty much sum it up. He never seems sad. Hey, Francie. Hello there. <laughs> I found out about the janitor contest from my kids, and they went to this school 20 years ago, and Grady was the janitor then. And they said everybody loved Grady. You have to do this story. And one thing I found out about Grady, he never forgets a kid. He remembered my children by name, no prompting at all. I didn't give him the names. 20 years after they were here, he remembered them like that. I know Jeff. You know Jeff yeah. because his daughters yeah, Erica and Marissa. went through here. Absolutely, yeah. 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 It's kind of hard to forget your friends. So, you know, when you think of these little guys as your friends, you know, it's kind of hard to forget those guys. It's hard to forget Grady either. As he puts it, you do what you can to make life better. All right, now have fun in music today, okay? Jeff Hirsch, Local 12 hey, News. Hello there. What a great guy. I hope he wins. And the winner, by the way, of that competition gets $2,500. The school gets another $2,500 worth of supplies. This is an online vote, and you'll find a link on local12.com if you would like to vote. Besides Grady Harris, there is another Cincinnatian among the 10 national finalists, Mike Woodruff, who is the janitor at McNicholas High School. Good luck to both of them. God, that's a great story. Isn't yeah, that awesome? It's such a good news story. Absolutely, I love that. yeah.